Okay, so this is night two of my playthrough on Dantooine on Kultor. I advanced the game just a bit because there was a lot of running around, turning in quests. And this is the Matali in Sandral Feud. It's a common quest here on Dantooine, Sandral, Matali Feud. It's two families, basically, I already know what's going to happen. We have to talk this to this droid here. By what authority are you trespassing on this estate? I come on behalf of the Jedi Council, and I wish to speak Alan Matale, because I am a Jedi. My balls are bigger than yours. You have come from the Jedi Council. Master Matale wishes to speak with you. I will inform him that you are here. Remain at this location. Do it, droid. I command it. Look how sexy Bastille is. Obviously, this guy's a state. He has a lot of credits, he's wealthy, he has a bunch of battle droids. My protocol droid tells me you are here on behalf of the Council. I was beginning to think <laughs> my demands like had been ignored. Though I think your time would be better spent interrogating the Sandrals as to the whereabouts of my son Shen. Last time my in-game music volume was a little too loud, so I, I fixed that a bit. I have already told my story to the Council. Why did they not inform you of my circumstances? I did not expect such incompetence from the Jedi, but I shall repeat the tale once more. Many years ago, I brought my family here to Dantooine to escape, escape the oppression of humanity on the core world. Yes. Soon after we settled here, the Sandrals arrived. The Sandrals. And they have been a plague upon my house ever since. Somehow I imagine the story from the Sandrals would sound just about the same. Nice goggles, Don't Dick. You? The injustices the Sandrals have committed against the Matales are far too numerous to name. But the Council is well aware of our many disputes. Recently I discovered several Sandral droids trespassing on my land. I have what no idea here? what nefarious purpose lay behind their arrival. My own assassination, perhaps. Destruction of my property. Maybe a simple spy mission. I wasn't about to find out. My own security droids destroyed the invaders. Not a single one survived. Ew. It was shortly after this incident that Shen, my only son and heir to the Metali estate, vanished. Obviously, Nurik, the unscrupulous head of the Sandral clan, has abducted my son in retaliation for the That's destruction of his because he's having boys. sex with her, his daughter. I shall go speak to Nurik Sandral, because I am Revan, the galaxy's badass. The only resolution possible is the immediate return of my son. Why Such does the council insist on stalling? The life of my son is at stake. Is it possible? Yes, of course. Now I understand. I am a man of the world, Jedi. I know how things are done. I will make a contribution Ooh, of a thousand to credits me. to the Council in exchange for rescuing Shen from the Sandrals. I want 10 million I will credits, present the bitch. credits directly to you, of course. Whether the Council ever learns of this donation is completely up to you. <laughs> the Jedi cannot be bought. I will remain neutral despite your attempted bribe. Or I could say, I understand you're upset. Well, I'm Natale. Rest assured, I will find Shen. Or number three, think of 2000 and you have a deal. But I'm playing a light side brat, so number one. Nevertheless, my offer still stands. A thousand credits for Shen's safe return. Know, however, that I will not sit idly by much longer. Eventually, I will take whatever action is necessary to rescue my son, including raising the entire Sandral estate. You okay, would be willing head. to risk open war over this. It is the Sandrals who have started this, not I. And here I thought you would blame us if we failed. It seems everyone is responsible for your actions, except for you. I don't need to stand here and listen to such impertinence. <laughs> I'm impressed, Carl. That interjection was very Jedi-like. What can I say? You pick up a few things. I'm afraid Alana's not just making idle threats. Look at her He's backside. Rash and so foolish sexy. enough to attempt a full assault on the Sandral estate. Such action would result in an all-out war between the families. I've seen men like Alan Matale before. He's so convinced that his hatred is justified, he's prepared to do anything. And if we don't intervene, there will be war. Until you find Shen, Jedi, 
We have nothing further to discuss. Jedi. I suggest you hurry south to their estate, lest I take matters into my own hands. Okay, fucktard. Alright, so I got a journal entry. Added experience points 150. I think it's to the south. I need to go uh, to the Natali estate. Okay, yeah, it is down that way. So, let me say that really quick, because I talked to this old fuck. Um, let's see, that bitch. Okay, let's go, um, not go down. Yeah, Master Speed. Bye, bitches! Now, in modding this game, I had to shut off the grass. Oh, I'm playing on a laptop. <laughs> Because I'm too lazy right now to play on a nicer PC, which I do have. And I sound like a tin box. Because I'm using a laptop camera. I'm beautiful. Because I'm lazy. I've downsized a lot in playing games to a laptop. Uh, Grove. I'm going the right way. Yeah. God dang it! You stupid things. Just destroy that beast. Oh, look at that! Oh, look at muscular. Damn! Fucking overpowered bitches. Fuck you up. You stupid cat. the back now. I think I looted it. There oh, okay. This is where it gets a little winded with the game. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, okay, they're all there. I can bypass this phone. Oh, fl flying manta rays up there. Flying bat. Play cat hound. Okay, so I'm approaching Sandril State. Or Matali, whatever. Yeah, Sandril State. So I'll save it here. I made it here. I put Karth in the party because he's a Republic soldier. Um, I think I leveled his ass up. Yeah. I really don't like his banter because he's too much of a goody goody. But it fits well with the storyline, so I'll keep uh, Hearth in here. And Bastila needs to come with me because it's what? a Jedi mission. Alright, so I gotta talk to this fuck car droid. This is private property. By what authority are you trespassing on this estate? Jedi bitch. I come on behalf of the Jedi Council. The Council? If you are here because of Shen Matali's disappearance, you are wasting your time. The Sandals are not involved. This is nothing but a Matali witch hunt. I am not in league with the Matalis, but I must speak to Nerik. Nerik left orders he was not to be disturbed, but given the circumstances, I will make an exception. Go into the main hall. Nerik will meet with you there. Okay, let's go, party. I have been informed by my protocol droid that you Oops. wish to speak to me. Your son cast. Oh, I found his body in the field, but I'm not going to tell him that yet. Uh, I'm here on behalf of the Jedi Council. I need to be neutral in this playthrough in order to get the correct dialogue. I'm investigating the disappearance of Shen Matali. I brought my family here to find peace and yeah. safety, not to be harassed and not treated like better. common Side criminals. Best. Your council has no authority here. And I respectfully ask you to leave this property at once. Jedi are renowned for their fairness in pursuit of justice. There is nothing to fear from us, unless you have something to hide. That's quite a line. You actually believe that? Don't you think someone is allowed to value privacy? Privacy is all well and good, but justice must be valued higher. Is it not obvious to you that this man hides something? She looks something? so much better than Actually, it is. All I'm saying is that he not everyone like welcomes card. the sight of a Jedi with open arms better get used to it. I trust you will show yourself out. If not, 
My security droids will be I think sure his daughter to comes out. With you. <sighs> when does she come out so we can progress to there she is, little slut. Basically she's banging the other guy. The you other are here father's from the council, are you not? Son. Looking for Shen Metale? Do you know something about Shen's disappearance? Who are you? My name is Rahasia. Nurik is my father. He has not been himself since Cassus disappeared. He is mad with grief, and he is convinced the Metales are responsible. He's not thinking rationally. Does this have anything to do with what happened to Shen? My father is a good man. When my mother died, he raised me and my brother by himself. He loves his children, and we love him. I just don't want you to judge him too harshly. I only want to find Shen Matale. You must understand that Father has been under a terrible strain. I have no wish to disobey him, but there are matters where even my father's authority is not absolute. Ooh, disruptive and undeniably rebellious daughter. Please tell me what happened. My father has kidnapped Shen Matale. He is holding him prisoner here in the compound. He feels this is a way to get back at the Matales. A way to get even for the disappearance of my brother Cassus. I see. Well, there is the answer we seek. The Jedi Council should be informed of this at once. You don't think that perhaps there's more to look at here, do you? That maybe everything isn't what the it voice appears? Reason. Of course not. It seems very simple to me. The Council must be allowed to decide the next step. No. Since Cassus went missing, my father has become unstable. He might hurt him if you do that. He no longer even cares if the Matales are responsible for what happened to Cassus. I'm afraid my father will simply kill Shen out of a mad, misguided lust for vengeance. <laughs> I must tell the Jedi Council at once! No, we're not going to be a little bitch. Um, this isn't my problem. No, that's not the correct answer. Number three, why are you telling me all this? That seems more neutral and to probe. Shen is an innocent victim in all this. My father is not a bad man, but his grief has driven him to madness. He must be stopped. Please, find Shen and rescue him before my father does something he will regret forever. I would take you to the prison, but I cannot let my father see me with you. Take this key. It will open an unguarded door at the rear of the estate. You and Shen can make your escape through there. There are many security droids guarding the halls. Great. Please hurry. You are Shen's only hope. That key line from All Stars is our only hope. Uh, what is the problem between your families? Why do you care about Shen? Shen and I, we, well, we have been taught by our families to hate each other. I just really for want being to know related more. to our fathers. I but I met Shen alone one day in the city, away from his father. And, and Shen was so charming, so sweet. He didn't care at all that I was a Sandral. He just accepted me for who I was, with no reservations. We talked and met again over months and fell in love. My brother Cassus met him too, and they were beginning to become friends. But then this whole mess had to happen. Please find Shen and free him. You are my only hope. Okay, ho. Let's go find your boyfriend. Bitch. Alright, let me exit. And I'm supposed to go to the side of the house. She gave me a key. Let's uh, save the game, probably. Uh, yeah, let's save it over here. Because if I fucked up, I can always go back to the other save. Okay, get in the side of the house. I think we need to buff up a bit because there's some stupid droids. What a bastard I go. Get over here, hoe. Alright, we'll put on forest armor. I'm go here. to her. Or shield. And while he's not a Jedi, he can just go take damage. Giant. What? Alright, we're buffed up here, somewhat. The first thing we get is a droid to our left. Oh, there it is! Let me, um... Uh... Does he have force? Destroy droid. Ooh! She's already just like, that's pretty badass. Look at that. Look at that. Look at her face. Like, Rah! I'm not even looking at the target. I'm like, Rah! but he's over there. Parf is the only fuck guard that's looking at him. And my guy's like, Ooh, what? <laughs> I'm here. Damn, Bachelor's got what? skills, bitch. 
fucked his ass up in one shot. Um, yes. Ah, these stupid mines. I keep all over that shit. Oh, dude, why can't I collect fucking names? Whatever. I can't even open that. Uh oh, this ain't good. No problem. Got it. Okay, let's see what we got. Dude, I can't even click on. Dude, what the? Something's wrong. <laughs> I think it's bugged. I don't want to jack anything, anyways. Dude, if <sighs> really, I hope this doesn't fuck up the game. Dude, I'm supposed to open these doors. No problem. Got it. There he is. Oh no, it's bugged! What the fuck? Why is it great, dude? This game. Yes. Oh. What am I doing? Uh -huh. Control droids. They may be programmed to attack on site. What? Oh, there it goes. I had I clicked something wrong on accident. No problem. Got it. I I hit the uh, uh, cheat pad code, even though I'm not cheating much in the game. Can't jack that bitch. I think there's a bunch of security droids in here. <sighs> oh, good. This is a security thing in there. Where's Boss Chiller? Bitch, she's not over here. This. Oh. Here. Oh, Alright, I got it, bitch. <laughs> Alright, so I can get some cool thing about these computer terminals. I can actually get some uh, XP from it. North hallway, accessing. Rough patrol droid targeting spikes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, view camera feed. Turn the override right menu. Computer room. Okay, overload oh, computer power conduct. No, not yet. Security room. Ooh, I get the oh, Cup Century Joy targeting program. <laughs> uh, fight. Uh, repair room. There's more stupid droids. Yes. And then uh, overload the conduit. Blow those bitches up. Try to bitch. Have a computer hacker, bitch. Download area schematics. Command storage room. Uh, we get a shit ton of uh, XP from hacking into this. Star Wars terminology is actually called splicing. Splicing. The more you mow. Okay, view storage room by central security room. Got that one. Storage room. I got that one. Sure, sometimes I click a little too fast. Sound power computer room. Okay, I'm in there. You know, last time I did that, I killed myself. North hallway. Okay. Okay, I think I got everything. Alright. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Now I can save this bitch and go talk to that punk fuck. And tell him his little girlfriend's waiting for him. Cool. Basic targeting computer. I get give that to uh it's his face. Who are you? What do you want with me? Are you working for my father? Does it look like I am? I'm here to rescue you, Shen. Rescue me? No. I won't leave. It's too dangerous. Ugh, bitch. I'll protect you. Shen, let's go. It's not my own safety I'm concerned about. I'm worried about the fate of Nurik's daughter, Rahasia. She's been trying to convince her father to release me ever since I was captured. I call if her I Russia. escape, Nurik will think Rahasia is to blame. Nurik is insane with grief over the loss of his son, Cassus. If I leave with you, it is Rahasia who will suffer. I cannot allow that. Fucking simp. I gotta be such a simp, dude. How can I get to come with me? What if we take Rahasia with us? Fine, stay here and rot. <laughs> if you don't come with me, man, I would choose number three, but I'm coming light side. I have to be a simp too. If you can convince Rahasia to escape with us, I will accompany you. 
Though I do not know if she'd be willing to turn her back on her home and family. Who could imagine a Sandril doing such a thing for the sake of a Matali? But if she will not go, then I too shall stay. I would rather face my own death than have her face her father's wrath because I escaped. <sighs> Why do you care about Rajasia so much? I was taught to hate the Sandrils, to think of them as evil and subhuman. But from the moment I saw Rahasia one day in the city, I knew that my father was wrong. She yeah, was like an first angel, balls. all white silks and perfume, seeming to float above the crowds. I don't know what else I could have done but fall in love with her. For months I wooed her and tried to win her heart. I believe I have succeeded, but now this has happened. Our families are always coming between us one way or another. Please find her and convince her to run away with me. Okay, you fucking sin. Let's go find this fucking bitch. <laughs> what? I'm not a non-member? Security control room. Ooh, more shit to loot. Bitch. Computer spike. Whoa, Bostula? God, your tits are in the way. More shit, I jack. Uh, I thought I shut these fuckers down. <sighs> Let's give them some lightning and attack them. And I'll do a faster flurry. Whoa! Oh, look at that strength! Nothing here. Prison key. Ooh. There she is, Rahuja. First, I'm gonna jack your shit, bitch. What are you doing here? God dang it. Have you found Shen yet? Uh, I'm trying to rescue Shen, but he won't leave without you, Rahuja. Shen can be so stubborn sometimes. If one of the security droids sees me wandering the halls, Father will get suspicious. I can't risk it. I'm surprised Father did not hear all that bashing of all his killing his droids. Father. Tell Shen I will meet you outside the gates. I will wait as long as I can, but you must hurry. <laughs> Imagine if we don't go to get shot. And she left her room. I can go jack her shit. 25 credits, bitch. Get a left with your shit. Oh, I already looted this shit. Alright, now I think this bitch is over here. There you are, fuck hard. You're back. Have you spoken to Rahasia? Uh, maybe. I pray she is not just telling yes. me what I want to hear, I was, but I will have to take that sad. chance. Hurry then, we must not keep Rahasia waiting. I forgot to voice act that. Shen, okay. you're safe. Rahasia. Well, thank goodness you managed to escape. It was all thanks to this kind Jedi that we managed to get this far at all. I thank you, Jedi, for all that you have done for us. Shen's father promised me a war. <laughs> We should get out of here quickly. There was no problem. We should get out of here quickly. You're right. We should go as fast as we can. I don't know how long it will be before my father realizes we're gone. You're right. We should. Here comes the old fucker right now. <sighs> there you are, Shen. Father! Mr. Matale! Rahesha! Father! Mr. Sandril! Nurik! Alan! <laughs> I knew this was all your doing! I knew you had captured my son! You had taken my Cassus from me long before that! You started it! I don't want to hear any of your excuses! Now I will get revenge for your transgressions! Uh, you just two need to calm down, or don't make me intervene in this. Why don't you two just shoot each other and get out of it? I would love to shoot that one, but I am playing a light side Jedi. So, I will select... Please listen to him, Father. Why should I listen to the Jedi? All you want is to remain with that Sandral harlot. My daughter is not a harlot, Matale dog! You should try to sort this out together. Why don't you try listening to your children? Both of you calm down, number one. I believe number three is the correct answer. Why don't you try listening to your children? 
Our children don't know enough of what's good for them to make a reasonable decision. Ew. It's better to let older, wiser heads like ours make the decisions. Raheish and I don't want you to make decisions for us. We want to live alone away from you. You, you insolent boy. <laughs> if you want to live alone, then so be it. I disown you. Oh. Never set foot in my house again. Will you go with Shen Rahasia? Shen. Number two. I think, I believe it's two. Will you go with Shen Rahasia and be a simp? Rahasia, you will not leave with this, this Matale boy. I am, father, and you can't stop me. We're leaving for the Enclave. You foolish girl. <laughs> they ran away. Let them go. Do not be selfish, Derek. Do not try to force them to return. I believe the third one is the correct answer. So. You expect us to just let them leave? Droids, stop them! You will not turn your droids on my daughter. Droids, don't let them take Rahesha. We appear to be at an impasse then. And they got away. It is your fault, darling. You were always too violent for your own good. Me? You were the one who rushed out here with war droids. <laughs> Shut up, number three. As much as I would like to select that, that's not the answer. Both of you, calm down. You don't need to fight anymore. You don't need to fight anymore. I will not rest until I have my Shen back. The council will hear of the troubles you caused, Jedi. Oh, you Indeed bitch me out to the council. Shall. You're gonna bitch me out. Oh, damn it. I think I was supposed to have it as a light side ending. But that's fine. I'm gonna end this piece here and progress the game a little bit. Because we have to get off the planet somehow. And then, uh, yeah, that'll work. So, this is the second video in my playthrough. Uh, a lot of these, there's a spacecraft up there. A lot of these are a little longer than I expected uh, because of the side quest. He's just like looking at it. Hey, baby, you want to go in there? And he's like, 